what is up and uh, I did say I was going to end the episode in the last episode at the end of the last episode I said I was going to end it and uh, we were going to be in this battle now where is that general we're holding on tightly um, so this is we're in the thick of it of another battle um, we're doing well we're get more of the Corsair missiles us we've lost a lot of cav but um, that's to be expected to be honest um, now where's their general I don't really know Oh, there he is. After him, there's only three left. If we can kill him, we should be able to hold our ground. Um, how's our archers doing? Good. Are our men holding? They're doing very well. Enable fire at will. Quickly, we surrounded him. Kill him. Bloody hell. There's only three left. If we can kill him, I'll be so happy. Um, how are we doing? We've killed. Uh, we're just a little bit of a head. Oh, shit. None. Um, have we killed him yet? Two left. Yeah, actually, let's blow our horn. We can't. Um... We're holding it. Whoa, what's over here? Uh oh. The spearmen. Come on. Why are they pushing into him? Oh, actually, that's a good idea. Let's hit him from behind. Ah, oh, MC, stop playing COD4, mate. Ah, oh, yes, we killed him. The heir of the Haradrim is dead. Now who's shaking? Hit the back of him and then fall out again. They're broken. Good. Now hopefully we can even win this and we could even take Umba if we really wanted to. But my uh, cavalry is extremely tired. We've lost half of, our men. of course we lost half of my men. What the hell do you expect? We're still holding fast and well. Oh wow, the, they're broken. Okay, you know what? Quickly pause for a sec. Get everyone off the defensive. And uh, let's go on the all-out attack. Now what is... I think the uh, no the archers are still not in there. We can keep pushing everyone in. We should be all right now. Run, <laughs> everyone, run! Actually, actually, move this back because we'll get the archers. To, I mean, we'll get the cavalry to run down the people routing. But that's what you get for coming out of your settlement. The Haradrim. This is our first battle against the Haradrim. I didn't even know. Like, I didn't notice. Like, I just, I don't know. I just didn't really notice, but we don't have to go and attack the settlement. Uh, we'll just try to kill as many of them as possible. I uh, hopefully we don't actually have to go and take it, like actually go physically in there and be like, oh, capture the town centre. Let's speed it up. And we'll see what we have to do. I hope we can nearly gobble them up before they get What is up and is going on guys and welcome back to the campaign map. Unfortunately, my game crashed. I don't know why. I think for some reason my Medieval 2 uh, Third Age runs fine, absolutely fine. Does not crash through our whole campaign, but sometimes when I record with Fraps or well, something, yeah, not all the time, but sometimes it just crashes and the worst possible time for it to crash was in the battle. But we ended up did winning. Heroic victory, so that's actually close that and we actually took the settlement of Umba. Now, um, sorry if my voice sounds a little bit drained or I sound a little bit exhausted, a little bit knackered, but um, most of the faction, okay. Um, to be honest, uh, I actually stopped recording, I just stopped recording then a FIFA 13 Road to Glory. So I did four of them just while the, my parents, uh, my brothers are out. And uh, so I can quickly get as much 
commentary done as possible because it's kind of awkward when they keep on walking in all the time. So there we go, we just sacked Umba. And uh, let's get out of there as quick as possible. Wow, we got a hundred thousand for sacking it. And uh, let's actually get out of there before the Haradrim can uh, raise another army. So that's awesome. That was a really good tactic. We sacked the city, we destroyed it. And uh, that's what you get, Umba. So let's move down further down. Then I think there's another settlement here somewhere. So um, let's continue on with the Third Age campaign. So, okay, now I'm trying to remember what happened. Uh, what was going on? Okay, we've got everything going good over here. Um, I think... Oh! Who's this? Luggan. Have they still got that settlement there? Mordor, yes. Okay, let's actually continue the diplomat. We'll put him up north. Actually, I'm going to quickly have a bit of a save. See, I've, I've, I've attempted so many campaigns, Orcs of Gum. <laughs> I've attempted so many campaigns just to kind of test them out, but I've never actually, I think I've only ever finished one campaign, like fully the dwarves, and then I've attempted one on my channel. So I really would like to finish this campaign, get a campaign up, and uh, finish it. So, I don't know why that's doing that, it's kind of weird. But, um, oh, okay, so... There's half a stack there, the, the armies are mauled or are marching, but we should be alright, we've got, especially if they attack with a, a full stack, we should be able to defend that very comfortably, else Gilead. And if Kalandros gets attacked, we can also bring up some more troops. So, ah, we can actually build our first lot of Gondor infantry, so let's do that then. Awesome, because we've got so much extra money now, that's absolutely redonkulous. Um, let's actually recruit lots, a couple more troops, and we'll just bring them back to us. Actually, we'll take them to Kalandros. Because, uh... Oskiliath doesn't really need it. Um... How are we going down in Pedigree? Oh, we can even recruit some more troops. Why not? And I think we can recruit some here as well. Aha! We're getting, the, we're getting an army ready and up. So, I think it's turn... It's in the turn. I'm going to have a quick sip of water. Because my throat's absolutely caning me. Because, obviously, like I said, I recorded 4 FIFA 13 Road to Glories and they go for talking... I think they roughly go for about seven minutes each. Mm. My voice is kind of drained. Ugh. Um, thieves guild and umba. No, rioting and umba. That's what you'd expect. Um, let's have a look down the coast. Ah, some troops there. That's disembark and attack. Hopefully this one doesn't have a garrison script. I don't think it should. So we're going to sack this town. We're doing the opposite of what the Haradrim are going to do to us. We're running down there, sacking the center. But we can we can retake Umba. I'm really hoping that they rebel. So then there'll be a, like a half a stack there that uh, the Umba, I mean the uh, Haradrim will have to deal with. Okay, that's actually now... Let's send this army over to here. So we can regroup the south just in case they get pissed and decide to send up an army. Um, put these troops in Colandros. These look sick. I can't wait to have more of these Gondor infantry. Just the armor looks so sexy. <laughs> um, how many turns do we have to wait? Nine. <laughs> yeah, I kind of guessed that. Um, we're doing well. We're doing exceptionally well. Um, there's going to be probably another battle down here, but... Sending if they don't bring it up in more troops, we'll just auto resolve it, sack the settlement, and go on to the next one. Because they do own these islands here as well. So let's have a wee look at that. We're doing well. I'm really happy with the way this campaign is going. And uh, yeah, hopefully, there'll be some battles very shortly. So let's have a look. Can we recruit some stuff? We could recruit some more knight stables, Gondor, practice range. What can we recruit here, though? Archer militia. Sorry, what's that then? Oh, we can create some more archer militia. Okay. Let's actually just put in put some stuff into the economy. I reckon bump out with irrigation. Oh, uh, we got some farms building here. We got nothing building here. How are we going in Pedigree? Merchants wharfed. Um, chicken farm. Population growth, stables, fairgrounds. Yeah, let's do that. Um. What I want to do is actually recruit some more ships. So 
I think that's enough. We've allocated that very well. And uh, now we're just going to have to wait for... Oh, we have to talk to the Sylvan Elves. I want to get some map information and... Uh, I don't think we can get trade rights because they're too far away and we've got no bordering towns with them. Ah, I just want to have another sip of this water. Woo! Lothorian reached. Yep. Um. Awesome. Most advanced faction. Alright. Ah, new family member. Boromir, Autobiographer, Faramir, Stuart of Denethor. They're getting all these... Oh, the High Elves in Isengard are at war. They're getting all these traits that builders get because I'm not really going to war with them or anything. Um, we'll just go map information for map information. Sinnings are on the other side of the world and I do believe we have good relations with them. So I'm skipping these intros because I do believe... Ampsy, mate, what are you playing at? Here offline, I always forget to do that. Um, uh, what was I saying? I, if you show that copyrighted content more than 30 seconds it becomes copyrighted so I don't want to risk it even having it on my channel so yes it's only because the creators of this game obviously know that they're going to be for YouTube use so it doesn't matter if you own the game but if you upload it to YouTube and earn money off it it's not yours so oh the Haratrim took their city back uh, how are we doing here five to none decent did I occupy the settlement? Now that I think of it, I accidentally might have. <laughs> um, what do we get? Sack the settlement. We'll just exterminate the population. And then we'll sack everything. Even though there's probably not much to sack here. Nope. But then this guy's going to get a lot of dread, isn't he? Oh, oh well. Um, let's rally out the troops and get out of here. Put it on high tax. And uh, let's have a look at the island here. So, I think it is time to end the episode. Uh, we did a couple of cool things. We're moving the heavy militia into the settlements, getting them recruited, getting our modernized army up. Mordor hasn't moved, and uh, we sacked Harad. We sacked a uh, Vit Avia, Vitavia, and uh, looks like everything is fine and dandy. So, nevertheless, there'll be more Third Age Total War and more FIFA tomorrow. So, if you're really enjoying this campaign, I hope you are really enjoying this campaign because I'm any. Ugh, I need to reword that. I hope you're enjoying this campaign as much as I am. It's fucking awesome at the moment. Put in the comment section down below suggestions of troop movements, where to attack, when to attack. And uh, buildings, construction, all that jazz. Oh, now that I think about it, let's have a look at that air. It was a girl again. Anyway, but without further ado, I'm going to end the episode here. This has been Simsy. I'm out. Lays my friends. Hope you enjoy the campaign, and goodbye.